Hey guys, it's Charlie, and I'm your Thursday sub on Peg and Perspective Subs Week, and this week's topic is, who do you work for? This week's topic comes from, I'm sorry if I'm saying your name wrong, Shanir Vu, I hope I'm saying that right, and Shanir says, I wanted to know if there is anyone or a pantheon of gods, goddesses, or spirits you work with, or have you worked with many different ones? What are your thoughts on working with beings like angels, spirits, gods, goddesses, demons, or the Fae? Do you believe in any of them, and why? Do you think any of them are truly evil or good? So as you may notice from my um, original introduction, I did change my clothes, and the reason is because I filmed it yesterday, but I'm redoing this part today because <coughs> It was completely, like, I couldn't get my thoughts all together, but, um, basically, my thoughts on this, um, will just kind of break down the question. I wanted to know if there is anyone or a pantheon of gods, goddesses, or spirits you work with, or have you worked with many different ones? And there isn't a specific pantheon, and I don't have patron deities, and the reason that I don't is because, um, to me, I don't necessarily believe that deities are like actual physical like real I guess um, to me it's more of like different aspects of deity or um, you may have seen in my in my spirit video which actually I think I'll post this one before I post the last week's topic on to my personal channel but I basically talk about how I kind of see everything and spirit as everything and to me that encompasses all of the deities so I don't have specific patron deities and I don't follow a specific pantheon of gods or goddesses because I feel like I can call upon some aspects of god and goddess which I believe god and goddess are actually one it's just kind of broken down into you know male and female or solar and lunar you know I covered that in another topic and then it breaks down further into different aspects that are different gods and different goddesses and I just believe that that's an easy way for people to personify this specific universal energy so I don't necessarily when I think of say Isis I don't think of Isis as an actual having been an actual god goddess I suppose but more as um, a personification of this specific aspect of universal energy, if that makes any sense. Um, what are your thoughts on working, working with beings like angels, spirits, gods, goddesses, demons, or the Fae, and do you believe in any of them, and why? And I do, <coughs> excuse me, I'm getting over a cold, I do believe in them, um, in that I believe in I think that Ariander put it really well when she was saying that they have specific energies or specific like aspects and I definitely agree with that because to me like I said everything that exists whether we know about it or not so like whether we've discovered it or not to me is all one and the same so these are just different aspects of one specific universal energy and that you and I all come from in my beliefs um, the same universal energy so we ourselves may also reflect different aspects just a different facet on this multifaceted diamond that is universal energy um, as far as working with any of these specific energies I do work with um, I don't work with angels but I'm not opposed to working with angels I work with spirits as in spirits who have passed on like my loved ones if I need protection sometimes I will call upon my grandfather um, gods and goddesses, I do. Um, demons, never, because to me, um, Pat, you guys may know from my personal channel, I talk about Pat a lot. He was the worst witch 13 until his YouTube was accidentally deleted. But we actually had a conversation on this very topic a couple weeks ago, and <coughs> he kind of brought to my attention something that really I kind of aligned with, and that is that when you have people or events that happen and the people either die or have a tragic life or death or these events are specifically tragic that leaves sort of an energy signature behind or an energy imprint and that imprint 
is able to, negativity, breeds negativity, like attracts like, so it collects on more negativity and eventually can create this giant mass of negativity that is able to be um, manifested. So um, some people who are extremely sensitive to it may pick up on those different imprints or signatures. And so I think that um, it can kind of all collect together and manifest itself as whatever we see or that we can subconsciously manipulate that energy into manifestation and see what we want to see or what we are expecting to see. Um, the other part of the question is, um, do I believe that any of them are truly evil or good? And I don't believe that either are truly just evil or truly just good because I believe that this energy, this universal energy is neutral and that it is basically uh, large groups of people or uh, collective consciousness that creates the negative and the positive of these energies and um, that if they are negative and positive there's enough to counteract both to make everything neutral but I don't believe that anything is inherently good or inherently and then um, any experiences say that people have shapes them into who they are and likewise any I guess thoughts because we all know that thoughts create energy thoughts are energy and energy creates matter so any like lots and lots of the same kind of thought or the same idea about something can all kind of go together and make whatever we're talking about manifest as whatever we expect it to be. So that's sort of a little bit watered down, concise version of the video that I originally made, but um, it's this topic for me is a lot deeper than I wanted to go, uh, just because I would be talking for like a half hour. So um, hopefully you guys found it interesting or at least maybe kind of know where I'm coming from with this point of view. But if you want me to go a little bit more in depth, I can certainly just let me know and I can make a video about it in more depth in on my previous on my previous on my um, personal channel. So just let me know and I will talk to you guys later. I love you. Blessed be.